Hello there, I'm Rylan, and I was solo mining Ethereum for almost three months. First of all, what does solo mining mean? It means when you are mining instead with a pool of people, you're mining by yourself, and the benefit of mining with a pool is that you don't have to wait so long to get a payout, because your goal is to hit a block on the blockchain and you get a reimbursement of that. Now, with Ethereum, particularly, it, it takes so long to actually hit a block, it's almost impossible for me it would have taken me about a year and I did it for three months and I was just testing my luck to see if I would have been able to do that but I was not unfortunately I just decided that I would just move on from this and uh, start working on other projects because there's plenty other projects to mine and not only just other projects but just mining ethereum and getting paid out in Bitcoin is probably just gonna be an a better outcome for me but there's plenty of other projects also to mine like flux raven ergo i haven't looked into ergo yet and i want to there's just plenty of other things to do and i felt like i spent enough time doing this and i haven't gotten much success now i did it with raven coin and i hit a block if you remember that i'll leave a link to that video down in the description if you want to check that out about me hitting a raven coin block for those of you who are curious right here it says i hit 24 percent luck right here I did say 25 but ever since I stopped mining to it it went down and that does check out about three months worth of solo mining is one fourth of a year and then a whole year would have been 100 percent if you don't know what luck is luck is the average amount of time it takes to hit that block and 100 percent would be the average amount of time now it may have gone past that 100 percent but 100 percent would still be the average amount of time that it would have taken to hit that block so here I had a roughly about a one in four chance to hit that block and make the four thousand dollars you see right here now that didn't happen unfortunately and it is what it is but you know again like I said move forward to other projects and I don't think it would be wise just to continue solo mining for the rest of Ethereum's lifespan in the time that I solo mined I lost about seven hundred dollars in potential profit and then I spent $200 in electricity. Actually, almost $300 because I've been doing it almost three months now. So like $250, something like that. But anyway, I'm not disappointed in making this decision to solo mine. But, you know, it is what it is. And I just got to move forward. And I'm just going to take what I have and, you know, just work on other projects. And mine other projects. And look into other projects. And that's what I'll do. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.